guys it's Hoyana and today I have a haul for you guys I realized that I haven't filmed a haul in a while and I've inquired a lot of books lately so I mean if you can already see like my bookshelf here is empty like I've already like had I've had these books for a while I put them up like and everything so um I was going to film some other videos but I feel like I have a lot of books to haul like i have a lot of books to show you guys that i've hauled i got a lot of books this month surprisingly for a girl who only babysits for 40 dollars a week so yeah um i have a lot of books so let's get into it so the first book i have is horror store by grady hendrix and i've already talked about this book multiple times on my multiple times i've already talked about this book multiple times on my channel i have a I have a book discussion I talked about it in my um October wrap-up so I mean you guys already know my feelings about this book and everything else that goes along with it next I have The Room which I'm very hurt because when I got this book I thought that I was gonna have the cover which was the main reason why I bought the book to be honest like okay the book sounds into it it's like a girl who has been kidnapped and she has a baby and it's told from the baby's perspective and the baby's like five years old and i was like okay yeah that sounds interesting but the cover i don't know i just liked how it was like all white and it was like written in crayon and like different colors and i really enjoyed that i didn't care enough to like contact them so that's like my personal problem honestly so next we have a study in charlotte which i solely got because um books with the blonde books with the blonde because of rocky from blonde with the book I actually was like always interested in this book. I've never read um uh Sherlock Holmes. I never read Sherlock Holmes or I never I never like read or watched Sherlock Holmes. I don't know anything about Sherlock Holmes. Like I know nothing. But I remember watching the book trailer and it was like the most intriguing book trailer I ever watched before. And I know Rocky from a blonde with the book like literally like lives by this book so i decided why not check it out and it's so crazy because when my sister picked it up she was like she was like you have a um a sherlock holmes or something like oh my god how did you know that so that if that doesn't show i guess like by the cover she knew or like maybe it was like right here i don't know but yeah next i have the wicked d which i wanted to read in october but i never got to I feel like November is going to be my month where I read all the spooky books and I'm a little um, upset. Not upset, but I'm a little, uh, I'm a little upset with myself for not reading any spooky books. So I feel like October is, a, November is the month where I'm going to read like all the spooky books I want to read in October. And I know that um, Minka just finished reading this book and she freaking loved it. She said she gave it five stars and she said that the plot twist was really good so what well, she said like everything about the book was really good and i just i'm obsessed with this cover like i want like the paperback cover is not as beautiful as the hardback and like look look on the inside okay and it's crazy because with booktube like you hear about a book so much that like you can tell what the book is about without ever reading it. like i know this book is about three witches who were drowned and every year sometime in the year they every year they come back and they take the body of three girls and that's what i know for the most part and that's all you really need to know to read it i guess i have city of ghosts by victoria schwab which i'm going to be doing a review on soon i speak on it a little bit in my october wrap up so i'm just gonna leave that that how it is and then i have vengeful by v schwab and you're probably like rihanna how do you freaking have vengeful when you've been reading vicious for the past month okay i literally been reading vicious since september since the beginning of october okay i've been on page 90 in that book for the past three weeks and i freaking love it so i know that i'm gonna love it when i get to the end of it so i just bought this book and also by reading um because city of ghosts is technically my first book i finished by her and i freaking love her writing so i'm like i know i'm gonna love i know i'm gonna love vicious then i got the coldest girl in cold town and i was so upset because i like holly black 
and but like and vampires are interesting but like i'm not i'm a werewolf kind of girl okay i am team jacob i you know werewolf is like my brand basically especially you know that know this if you follow me on twitter like you know werewolves are my brand i was watching a um book talk i was watching a video and it's like really really old video and they were talking about this book and the way they talked about it made it seem like it was about werewolves so i'm like oh well there's not a lot of like good teen werewolf stories that i know of that are like not on wattpad because most werewolf stories are like um adult which i don't mind but i was like oh it'd be cool to check out a good teen werewolf story i know it's a standalone so it'd be good to like get me into werewolf stories that aren't on wattpad because honestly that's all i ever read like i have yet to find a werewolf story like a real book so i thought that this book was a werewolf book so whoever convinced me that you lied to me and i really need to stop taking i really need to stop taking recommendations from booktube because you are all liars okay i'm still gonna read it because i really enjoy holly black's writing but you are all liars so then i bought caraval which i know is um yes i hope i pronounced her name right and the cover is so beautiful i know it gets like a lot of mixed reviews like some people love it some people hate it so um i really want to check it out because i know legendary book cover is beautiful too um this third book cover is not beautiful at all sister i don't know what she's doing but she's not beautiful um it's just so beautiful like I don't know it's just such a really cute book and I can't wait to read it then we have Thorn of Glass which I bought because I gave into the hype of I gave into the Thorn of Glass hype I gave into the Sarah J Mass hype I am ready to be Sarah J Mass trash um everyone was talking about Kingdom of Ash and I was just like like literally all of my friends, all of my friends, everyone I love talk was taught like everyone I love was raving about Thorn of Glass. So I'm like, okay, like it can't be that bad if like literally all of my mutuals and my friends freaking love this book. So I'll just give it a try. And I started a book club and it's called Time to Catch Up Book Club which um Vanessa thought of the name and I freaking love it so I it's on Goodreads and basically in this good book club what we do is we read popular books or over hype books that we just haven't gotten a chance to so for this book club I'm gonna do something where like um every month I pick one or three one or three books so like between one or three books and that gives everyone a chance to read something so like say like there's like a popular fantasy and then a popular contemporary and like say you don't read fantasy but you really want to be in the book club or say you don't read um contemporary but you really want to be in the book club so it's like something for everyone so like everyone can join so it's not just one specific thing and i'm gonna leave it down below and you should definitely like join this month our we only have one book because it's our first month so this month we are going to be reading thorn of glass so feel free to join us and read and we may even do a um live show we may even do a live show lastly i got batman the nightcrawler i'm not really a big fan of wonder woman i don't really care about wonder woman so i just completely skip that i do want to read it though i'm just gonna like skip over it for a little bit and i also am going to read uh catwoman but i figured batman would be the first book to start off with i think i might jump into this book today because i have nothing else to read like literally and i just love the cover to this and i'm really excited to get into the series i, I wish marvel did this like it would be so cool if marvel did this and if they come out with one for um villains like if they come out with one for villains because like a lot of my favorite villains are actually dc villains i will be so happy like give me poison ivy like give me harley quinn um i have another favorite but i can't remember her name at the moment so i'm trash but um my friend my friend jake um his channel is jk does books i believe i'll leave everyone i mentioned so far in this video down below and he told me like i need to read this so 
guess what I'm about to do? I'm about to read. And lastly, lastly, Chandler, Chandler said she was doing a Twilight readathon. So I said, I never read Twilight before. I love, I have a love hate relationship with the movies. I always, I watch, the, I rewatch the movies frequently so I can judge them, but they're also like my guilty pleasure. Like I love the movies. So I figured, why not read the book? So instead of buying one book, I brought the whole series. So I haven't even finished the first book yet. I do plan on, because it's why I, I, um, I do plan on doing like a video, kind of like what Night Reads and Smile did, which is basically like reading Twilight for the first time at the age of 20, but I'm not going to like vlog or anything because the chapters are long in this book and I am now two weeks behind. I am now two weeks behind in this series. So I got a lot of catch up to do. So yeah, that is it for this haul today. I hope that you like it. Um, basically, if you haven't noticed, I bought all of my books because I think the covers are pretty or because I'm giving into to the hype. So you can kind of see what kind of person I am. Um, if you decide to buy any of these books, let me know. Um, if you decide to, um, you should definitely check out my Goodreads group time to catch up um i'm very excited for it. i never like had a um book club before so you should definitely join and join us reading um thorn of glass maybe i'll start a group chat for it who knows uh yes thank you for watching my channel i hope that you had a good time here i upload three times a week because i have no life so yeah, bye.